it's Miss Beth, and today is story time day. Boop, 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 ba -da -da, boop. Yes, this is a day that I love because I get to share great stories with you. All right, today's great story is called Happiness is a Rainbow, written by Patricia Haggerty, illustrated by Summer Macon, and the publisher is Rodale Kids, an imprint, Random House Children's Books, a division of Penguin Random House, LLC, New York. All right, today we're going to practice our colors in this story, so pay attention because we're going to be talking about a whole bunch of rainbow colors. All right, happiness is a rainbow. Blue is the color of the sky and sea. Just like a bird, we feel happy and free. So here is the color blue. Different shades of blue all around. All right. Yellow is the color of a bright, shining sun. It makes us feel happy. It makes our lives fun. So can you find the different yellow pictures on this page? See, the sun is yellow. And the little ball has some yellow in it. And the little giraffe has some yellow. And look at the elephant. He's laying on a yellow raft. And the shovel and the sand is kind of on a yellow. Yellow and yellow. Awesome. Did you find all that? Ooh. We almost forgot the ice cream cream and the little heart. Ooh, there are a lot of yellow things on this page. Good job. Red is the color of a beautiful rose, the color of love, which blossoms and grows. This is red. And then there are many different red pictures on this side too. Okay. Green is the color of grass and the trees. We picnic outside with the birds and bees. Here's green, you see the green? The blanket is green, the trees are green. They even have green apples on the trees. Can you see a few other things that are green? Very good. Very good. That looks like fun to go on a picnic. Pink is the color of an early dawn sky. It fills us with joy. We can soar and fly. And this says happy. H-A-P-P-Y, happy. Do you see the beautiful pink color? Pink is the airplane, pink is the shirt, pink is the hot air balloon, and so much more. Can you find some more pink on this page? Very, very good. All right, let's see what's next. White is the color of ice and soft snow. We're sledding together. Look at us go! You see the white, all the snow, and the snowman is white. They even drew a little heart, and inside it you can see the white heart with the black outline. Can you find more white on things? Oh, good job, good job. Orange is the color of a fire that glows. A feeling of warmth that spreads and grows. See the orange? Here's the fire that's glowing. Different orange stars. Orange roof. What else can you find that's orange? Very good. You're doing awesome. Brown is the color of leaves in the fall and towering tree trunks that make us feel small. So this is the color brown. Brown is on the trees and the trunks. Up here is brown 
and then the leaves turn brown too. Can you find anything else that's brown? Awesome. Very good. It looks like maybe they're playing hide and seek in the forest. That would be so much fun. All right. Purple is the color of grapes, ripe and sweet. Refreshing and cool. They're a summertime treat. That is true. So do you see purple? The whole bottom here is purple. And then these grapes are purple. And look at that silly elephant with the grapes. Can you find more purple things? Yum, yum, delicious purple grapes. A healthy treat. All right, good job. We're happiest of all at this magical sight, a rainbow above us shining so bright. And look at, we just learned the colors of the rainbow. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue. This is indigo and then um, light purple or violet. And then we have white for the clouds. So what color is this? Sun. Very good. Yellow. And this bird is Blue. What color is this bird? That's right. Red. And this little, this little guy, he is orange. Can you find the green bird? Oh, awesome. And the yellow bird? Super good. You did great. All right. That was called Happiness is a Rainbow. Oh, that was a good one. You know I always love the stories that I read to you, so that was awesome, and you did fantastic. I'm so proud of you, so proud of you, because you did great. I am Miss Beth, and I hope you have an absolutely fantastical day, and I cannot wait to share stories with you next time.